What are we doing? Popping it out. Oh. <laughs> we are removing our windows because they're all leaking and the wood under it's getting rotted, so we're gonna pop it out and then fill it in with some foam and fiberglass. This isn't super wet. It's actually it's actually dry in there. Good morning, good morning. We are still in the process of fixing these gaping holes. We have sanded, we have fared, sanded again, fared again, sanded again. Now we have to fair and sand one more time. We have already sanded the entire inside of these walls. Then we have to prime and then we're gonna paint because a lot of under the windows was rotted and the varnish was coming off and it would have been a bigger project to kind of varnish everything. So we're just gonna paint it. <laughs> lost a lot of footage of these early projects due to Sierra's phone accidentally taking a swim but what we did with these windows is pretty much just cut and scraped out all the rotting soft wood and all the wet wood and we replaced the big chunks with foam and then fiberglass over that and then a lot of the rest of the stuff we just kind of fared back in and then we fared the edges of all the window cutouts nice and smooth and we sanded them down and then we painted the whole cabin top and all the inside walls before we replaced the windows. windows in but we have fared and sand and fared and sand everything and we have primed the inside we can't prime the outside yet because not everything's removed from the cabin top but we're gonna finish painting the inside today and hopefully remove everything from the cabin top and then maybe we'll eventually be done soon kind of maybe
that's what Casey says. Wow. This is my friend Ryan. So we've been doing a lot of work to the boat recently. Finally got all the windows in. And we got our new Lumar hatches up there. Well, they're up there. It's here stapling up this plastic that was up here before. And we're gonna panel the ceiling and get some lights up. This window's yeah. nice. 35 and three quarters. I guess we'll do this and this side first. Okay. Right? 34 and a quarter. Yeah. Make it zero. Four and a half in. Okay. Straight line. Almost done with this ceiling. We're using this like, what's this, FRP? Not even, is it FRP paneling? No, it's like plastic paneling. Working pretty good. It's kind of hard to deal with because it's not super sturdy, but once you trim it right and we get it up there, it's looking really nice. Pretty happy with it so far. I brought in the mathematician. I do what I can for adrenaline over here. And we're pretty much done. Not too many bubbles, just, yeah. yeah. Looks pretty good, what do you think? I think it did pretty well. We'll just put some trim up along the edges and piece right here. Yeah. Really brightens up the inside. We headed over to Home Depot and picked up some oak trim for the ceiling. They only had red oak, which definitely isn't ideal for the boat. You generally want white oak, but it's all they had and it should be fine for interior trim. Project. Billy's at work. I have another day off this week, so I am sanding the floor in our main cabin. Um, the reason we're doing this is because we have one spot right next to the door that's already like peeling, and we just redid the walls, the ceilings, and so we might as well finish everything now, and then it'll all be pretty. projects we've been working on has been getting all of our cushions and seats redone and we just got the call saying we're finished so we're gonna go pick them up we, we haven't really been working on them well we had to measure and clean and sand and reconstruct the size of our cushion so yes we have been working on it Come in. hey hello good how are you good good all right hello oh, so so you I guess to the wall and just do them on the back yeah and just flip, you just gotta flip them right yeah. so these are the rest of the inside and then the outside for the back yeah 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 all right bye thank you Carmel you're welcome